how is school? <laughs> Max, why are you carrying Alex's backpack like that? She told me my backpack was bending my spine, so she gave me her saving it out. <laughs> Let's check. There, all straight. You're welcome. Alex, your brother is not your pack mule. Yeah, I'm not your pack mule. I'm sorry, Maxie. Could you take this upstairs for me? Sure. Best day at school ever. Oh, they found the guy that was putting peanut butter in your locker? No, but this made me forget about that. Okay, so I'm in biology, right? When Mr. Medina has us pick lab partners. And like always, my partner ends up being the frog I'm dissecting. I have the opposite problem. Everybody wants me to be their lab partner. You don't take biology. That's what I keep telling those guys. Anyway, in walks this brand new girl, and she is the hottest thing I've ever seen in my life. Eva Longoria goes to your school? Eva Longoria? <laughs> Kids love Eva Longoria. It's, it's... <laughs> Continue, son. So Mr. Medina assigns the beautiful Miranda Hampson to be my lab partner. Miranda Hampson? Isn't she that new goth girl in 11th grade? <laughs> She's not goth. She just likes wearing black and dark makeup and listens to bands that are kind of scary. Oh, so not goth, but goth. You're missing my point. I'm in the 10th grade. She's an older woman. Add a boy like your mother. The hot part. Hold on, now the story gets even better. So me and my Moran, it's my cute nickname for her, actually. Yeah, Moran. <laughs> accidentally reach for the scalpel at the same time and our hands touch and she didn't pull away for three seconds. <laughs> How's that for a great day? Oh, look, Miranda's here. I guess your great day's still going on or coming to a tragic end. Let's watch, boys and girls. Uh, hey, Moran. Who's Moran? You. Remember? <laughs> oh. I called you that in lab. Oh. Right, I, I thought you were swallowing and talking at the same time. He does generate a lot of saliva. I have overactive glands. We're looking into it. It was worse when he was a baby. We had to wrap his head in a diaper. Excuse me. One second. Oh. Do you need to copy my biology notes or something? Oh, no, <laughs> no, I, I just... I came to ask you something. Are you going to the junior prom? Nah, I already told him I don't want to work lights this year. <laughs> oh, you are so funny. <laughs> no, I mean, would you like to go to the prom with me? I'm, I'm new at the school and I don't know a lot of guys and you seem very nice. Me? <laughs> well, uh, you know, I'll have to check the schedule. And are you trying to be cool? Yeah. Don't do that. Okay. I'm really tired of cool guys. Don't worry, because I am so not cool. <laughs> <laughs> well, you know, everything's gonna be a breeze. At the end, we'll no doubt just defy the moon. We can fix any problem with the slightest of ease. Yes, please. <laughs> With the Marietta Animata spell, you can make any object come alive. Max, you're up. See what you can do with that cup. Marietta Animata. Are, are you picturing it with arms and legs? No. You got cheese on the board, so I'm thinking about cheese. No. We don't have any cheese. We have a cup. <sighs> Justin, you're up. Justin. Justin! What? What? <laughs> Oh, uh, sorry, Dad. Um, you're not paying attention. That isn't like you. Yeah, it's like me, and you're not even doing it right. I completely check out. This place could be burning, and I wouldn't even know it. What's up, Justin? It's Miranda. It's, 
It's a junior prom. There's going to be dancing and a lot of time to talk, and I'm kind of nervous. Well, I'm kind of nervous. No one is paying attention to the lesson. Uh, I am. It's easy. All right. Well, put your magic where your mouth is. <laughs> Murrieta Animata. Alex, what did you just do? I did the spell you wanted. You're welcome. Hello, losers. We're supposed to be doing it on the cup. Well, the trophy seemed easier. It already has legs. See you at the finish line. <laughs> Sorry, Dad. Sorry, nothing. That was my first place in state trophy I got in high school. You better find that young lady before your mom sees it. You know how she hates magic running amok. Why is she still mad about all that stuff you said about evil Longoria? Yeah, Mom was pretty upset about all that stuff. Let's relive it. We'll play parts. I come on! Stop trying to change the subject. The rest of the lesson was going to be about how we unanimate stuff we've animated, and now we can't do that until you find that trophy. Class is over. Great, I'm already nervous about Miranda. Now I gotta worry about finding a stupid trophy. Oh, sounds like you got a lot on your plate. Let me know how that all works out for you. Guys, which is better for prom? Well, the tux says safe boy, but the zebra jacket says danger, danger, stay away from my daughter. Goth girl will like you for that. Whoa! Nice one! Aito! You guys can never agree on anything. Yeah, I think we pretty much agree, and that's the biggest zit we've ever seen. What zit? <laughs> ah! <gasps> okay, uh, well, it can't be that big, can it? Yeah, maybe, maybe the mirror's like a carnival mirror. Ow! You can hardly see it. No. <laughs> My baby has a zit como una montaña. That means like a mountain. This is gonna ruin everything. I can't take Miranda to the prom looking like this. Why not? She does like danger. If you go with that thing, she'll never know when it's gonna blow. What was I thinking getting involved with an older woman? Papito, calm down. I've got an old Mexican remedy here that is much safer than popping it. My grandmother created it. It works every time. Oh, thanks, Mom. We just smear a little bit of this on, then we wrap it tight in the banana bandana, and voila, in three days, gone. Three days? The prom is tomorrow, Mom. Oh, I just remembered a quicker remedy. Oh, okay, I'm gonna need rubbing alcohol, a wire brush, and a towel for you to bite on. What? No! This thing keeps beeping. The metal man must be close. Alex, you're on a metal staircase with a metal detector. Ah, oh, I just wasted an hour going up and down these things. Ugh, that puppy's ginormous. Why don't we just use the acne spell I use to keep my skin clear and velvety smooth? Alex, you're chasing a metal man. I don't think magic's your thing. I'm doing you a favor. Just hold your head still, okay? Alex, don't. Joel Magic Bits only causes Please, trouble. Please, I'm working. No, you got a trophy, Joel man. Run around the house because you got Murrieta a trophy. Murrieta Animata. Murrieta Animata. What? Is it gone? Did it work? Not exactly. That is crazy. Your zit just talked to me. You should hear me sing. Me, 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 me. I'll do anything but country. What did you just do? I don't know. You were yelling at me. I got confused. It's all your fault. Dad said to never yell at someone when they're doing a spell. No, he said don't yell at him when he's ordering takeout food. He was so peeved when his pork dumplings didn't come. <sighs> he's already mad about the trophy. If he finds out about this, we're both hosed. Excuse me, you're host. You did this. I'm just the guy with the big gross talking zit on my forehead. <laughs> Hello? I'm right here. <laughs> Alice, get this thing off of me. Come on. I got the trophy, man. It was easy. It was on the hamster wheel. Hamster? Not too happy about it. See, Justin, you don't have to get your boxers in a bunch. Now Dad will teach us the unanimation spell, and your zip problem will be over. Boy, 
I didn't even get a chance to spend Christmas with you guys. You animated Justin Zid? Oh, sweet, I want one. Oh, no, you don't. Ow, Trophy Man kicked me. <laughs> Keep on trucking. Whoa, whoa, hey, he's in my shirt. The tickles. <laughs> oh, my. <laughs> Okay. Ah, whoa. Hey, my underwear. Hey, you know what? I was wearing those for ten straight days. That's it. I'm calling Miranda and telling her I can't take her to the prom. No, 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 no. Wait. I, I can talk to Dad. I'm not gonna let my brother miss out on what might be his only prom because of some what ugly hideous thing on his face. You guys are really rude to company. It's so good. It's it's inspirational. In fact, it makes me want to be a better person. And I think I'm going to start with wizard's training. Really? Hey, here's an awesome idea I just thought of right now. Why don't you give me the unanimation spell you were going to teach us, and I'll start working on it. <laughs> oh, yeah. Why don't I just give you the whole spell book? We'll just call you a wizard. That sounds like a lot of reading. I'll just take the one spell for now. <laughs> Look. With wizardry comes responsibility. And that also means taking care of your mistakes. I'm not giving you that spell until you find that trophy. Where are you, trophy man? Mom has a bowling trophy. She's really cute. Tight top, short skirt. <laughs> Please tell me you got the unanimation spell from Dad. I got the unanimation spell from Dad. Oh, really? No, I just felt like I owed you some good news. <laughs> Oh, the thing's so big, I can't stop looking at it. But don't worry, I have a better plan. We're just gonna pop the stupid thing. Wait! I can help you with the girl! What? Don't listen to him. No, no, no! Oh, Justin, I can really help you! How? You were great with the girl in biology, right? What were you like outside of class? Well, I don't know. I don't know. Hold on, what could you do for him? Talk him through the rough spots. He's going with a girl almost as pretty as you. Oh, he's good. I still think it's a mistake. The mistake is not taking advice from somebody who's been on thousands of girls' faces. I know what they want to hear. I know exactly what you should say to them. Give me a chance, come on. Maybe I could use a wing zit. Yep, I see absolutely nothing wrong with letting a growth on your face tell you what to say to a girl. Good luck. <laughs> oh, oh, you're gonna have to stop sweating. It's getting into my eyes. When are you gonna start helping me? I've been talking about biology. That's all I got. I know. She almost jumped out of the cab when you kept going on and on about deoxyribonucleic acid. Just say what I say. Here she comes. Well, Denise says we look cute together. And she loves your jacket. You're the one who looks great. Thank you. Not you, the girl. Oh. You're the one who looks great. Well, thanks. You're sweet. <laughs> no, you're sweet. That's lame. Don't ad lib. You want to dance? Sure. <laughs> what do you know about dancing? Nothing. I'm a zit. Put the hat down. I don't want to see this train wreck. <laughs> You're a really good dancer. Justin's got a girlfriend. He's not my girlfriend. Girlfriend? Whoops. Don't panic. Hang in there. Well, okay. I'm your girlfriend. <laughs> wow, I never thought I'd be so grateful to a zit. <laughs> now you got your girl. Now it's time for the Z-Man to have some fun. Hey, you come with a fire extinguisher? Cause you're smoking hot. But how did you do that? Uh, <laughs> do what? I, I thought I heard you talk while you were drinking. <laughs> 
That wasn't me. Hey, baby. Have the cupcake and eat it real slow. That was you. That's rude. I'm sorry. Uh, hold on, Paul. <laughs> what are you doing? Oh, come on, dude. Lighten up. I got you the girl. Now it's my turn to have some fun. Hey, beautiful. Can I talk to your boyfriend? <laughs> That's it. I'm popping you. Not so fast, lover boy. Get a load of me. I'm engorged. You pop me and we both go down. <laughs> hey, zebra. Are you just making monkey sounds at me? Oh, look who's learned his animals. Hey, you got a trophy, man. Yep, nothing like a duct tape finish line to save the day. <gasps> Look, he's still trying to get out. <laughs> oh, it's Justin. Hey, how's prom? What? Huge 11th graders? How many? Look, I feel bad. I'll get this bell from Dad and I'll be there as fast as I can. Max, I gotta go help Justin at prom. Go get my jacket, the really cute one, the one that cinches at the waist with all the little buttons. Go. <laughs> oh, and my matching purse. I know the one. Daddy! I caught the trophy man. Great! You want to give me the on uh, animation spell now? Look, before we get into that, we need to sit down and have a long, serious talk. I know, I know. I'm grounded for three weeks. How did you come up with three weeks? One for using magic behind your back, another for letting the trophy man run around the house, and the last one for future trouble I'll probably be getting into. Well, that's one more week than I would have come up with, but we'll go with that. Okay, say, Gary Bay Immobilite. Gary Bay Immobility. Great. <laughs> Even though I don't got it anymore, I still got it. <laughs> I like the way I deal with problems. I think this purse goes better with this jacket. Now I got another problem. Guys, when I implied you didn't know your animals, what I meant was... You know, three against one really isn't fair. Yeah, I don't know a lot of what you just said, but uh, let's see if you can say it again without any teeth. Hey, Brian, there's, there's some loser in the hallway who says that you can't do 20 fingers at push-ups. Everyone knows I can do 50. Let's go show him. <sighs> Thanks, Miranda. Don't thank me. I just want to know what's going on. You're acting like two different people. Yeah, I'm sorry. I know I'm being worried. It's just that I really like you and nothing's going right. I like you, too. Can we start all over? Sure. Just a hug? I can get that from Grandma. How about some lip action? There you go again. You're a pig. Miranda. Wait. Dude, help me out here. I need a break. My hair going a little flat. I got to go pump it up. Oh, what? But, but I'm not hyping anymore. Yo, everybody listen up. We got a guest DJ in the Kansas room in the town and country suite. Give it up for DJ Mad Hatter. Yeah. <clears throat> um, <laughs> Justin in the his house, let's raise the ceiling, hoot hoot. <laughs> and this is a fast one for all the ladies, cause I loves to watch you shake that junk. There's nobody in the hallway. You must have scared him away. Ah, uh, hey, look. Justin Timberlame is up on the DJ stand. You know, let's take that freak down. Hey, guys, you want to dance? Hey. Why would we want to dance with an eighth grader? Get lost. I'm in ninth grade, you big idiot. What took you so long? Okay, if you really want to know, I missed the A train, so I had to catch the bus on 4th Street where this guy was selling the cutest earrings. Just it, Bob. Just do the spell. No. Stop. Don't do it. I can teach you how to drive. Gary Bay Immobilite. Oh! Did it work? Yep, you're back to your regular pimple-faced dorky self. Thanks. No, I'm sorry I got you into this. Now go out there and get your older woman. <clears throat> uh, excuse me. I'd like to apologize to Miranda Hampson for the way I acted. Miranda? <laughs> Not wearing my hat, am I? Good job. Now pop that sucker and run. That's all you got. See you at home. Hey, Justin. 
Oh, <clears throat> hey, Miranda. Miranda wanted to talk to you because I told her why you were acting so weird. Yeah, why didn't you just tell me you had a big zit? I would have understood. I've got one, too. Oh, man. Yeah, that's a honker. <laughs> Sorry, you two want to be alone. Look, I was so nervous about tonight. Why? Well, because I've never been to a junior prom with an older woman that I really like. No, it's okay. Because I kind of like this one younger guy right now. Oh, that's cool. I understand. Good luck with him. She means you, stupid! Oh. <laughs> right, yeah. Me. Oh. Okay. <laughs> Well, um, I gotta get home. See you in school. Not if I see you first. Mm -mm, stop trying to be cool. Okay. <laughs> Thank you so much for bringing Miranda. That's okay. I kind of owed it to you, you know, giving you the talking zit and everything. But I'm kind of gonna miss him. He was the only one around here who was almost as clever as me. <laughs> yep, you're so clever. Hey, you want to go get some ice cream? Sure. Yep, you're so clever. Now you're locked out. That's okay. I'll catch up with Miranda and tell her about your doll collection. <laughs> They're action figures! <laughs> so how long have you been in this line of work? Oh, since the first Olympics. But I was just on a medal back then. I've done all kinds of trophies. What about tennis? <laughs> World's fastest typist? Yeah. Oh, you know another trophy I've done? World's greatest kisser. All right, all right. It's past everybody's bedtime. It's time for you to get back on the pedestal. Alex? Gary Bay, Emo Village.